In today's video, I'm going to be sharing one base styled seven different ways for you guys. So these are some spring outfit ideas that are petite friendly, very minimal, classic and stylish and very wearable at the same time. Lately, I have been loving creating many different outfits with minimal amount of pieces. My previous outfit ideas that I've done is styling 10 wardrobe pieces in 20 plus different ways. If you're looking for tons of outfit inspiration for spring, I'm gonna link that video up here. But today I'm specifically styling one base and then going to be adding different layers to create different outfits. So the base that I'm working with today is a basic white tank and then some high-waisted navy blue slim straight trousers. And I specifically wanted to pick pieces that are light that way it is easier to layer on top of it specifically for spring as the temperature is getting warmer this tank quickly i got it from abercrombie i have been wearing it a ton lately even with my 21 week pregnant belly uh it fits really well so comfortable very stretchy it comes in a two pack i got it in a size small i have it in black and in white and these trousers i love them they are surprisingly so flattering especially me being pregnant at 21 weeks and I still have more room to wear them because of the stretchy waistband. I raved about these so much before I got pregnant. They were like my number one trouser and they still are. It's a nice style that I could still wear that is high-waisted and looks really flattering around my thighs and hips. Let's go ahead and start with the first outfit which is layering an oversized cotton shirt over with some white slides, a very big cross body bag. This one specifically is in a tweed texture, so it kind of elevates the outfit a bit, which is really nice. And this oversized cotton shirt, I've been sharing it so much lately from Cezanne, so it's definitely on the higher price end, but quality of it is truly incredible so thick i can wear it closed and buttoned up if i wanted to but this outfit specifically i'm wearing it open and it's just a perfect oversized fit that goes perfectly for spring and summer you can transition it into fall as well uh, it just fits perfectly oversized the length is perfect i roll up the sleeves and how it lays on your body is just so beautiful very thick cotton structured i've had inexpensive versions of this oversized shirt this by far takes the cake because the quality is there and just how well it lays. I feel so pretty in it, so relaxed and just it's perfect for spring. And then the next way I'm styling this base is something a little bit more dressy, kind of polished, uh, is with a striped jacket. This one is from Goelia. I shared it recently. I love it. It is so gorgeous. It's in a white and navy color combo, so it goes perfectly with these navy trousers. And the shoulders are padded, so it creates a lot of structure there. I roll up the sleeves. I think it looks really pretty that way as well. And I paired it with two-tone slingback flats that I've been raving about as well. Uh, and this is just a very chic, minimal, structured outfit that I think would be so pretty to the office or even outside of work. Next one, I love long length outerwear pieces. You guys know that this trench is actually a one I purchased last year from Banana Republic Factory. I'll double check if it's still in stock because this one is different from the Goelia one I've been sharing a bunch lately. This one is more of like a stiffer cotton, not as drapey as the Goelia trench coat I've been sharing a bunch. This one is longer in length and it has a little bit more volume in the body as well and I love it. I love this one. I love the Goelia one that I shared. They're different colors. The material is different, but they're both trench coats. I love just like the really long length. And I think it looks really pretty with the navy trousers and the white tank. And then I paired it with white slides and then this gorgeous minimal bag from Charles and Keith. I love the little hardware on it. It's like a little knot. And it's a crossbody bag where you can wear it on your elbow as well. The size is small on the smaller end. So phone, keys, wallet, maybe a few extra things in there you can't fit like a ton in there because it's a smaller purse but i think it works well for me i usually don't carry too many things with me anyways the next way is something that'll keep me a little bit more warm maybe if it's a little bit more of a chilly day uh is with this cardigan this oversized organic cotton again from quince i have been sharing this as well so much it is just the perfectly oversized fit i love the button detailing uh it just goes perfectly for spring and then this is something i would definitely wear 
in fall and in winter as well, just adding more layers on top. You can wear open or closed. I've shared many ways styling this in my other videos. And I wanted to style it with some strappy sandals, just kind of give the outfit a little bit more of a beachy, relaxed look. And then pairing it with a straw bag as well to tie the entire look together. So next outfit, I wanted to try something different. Uh, these shoes is something I thought I would pick up for myself. They're so different, but I don't know why I was so drawn to them. They just seem so perfect for spring and summer. Uh, I paired it with this blazer from Banana Republic Factory. The color is very similar to each other. And these shoes are big, so I wouldn't wear these shoes with like skinny jeans or anything like that or anything super tight. Since the shoes are big and kind of bulky, I like to balance it out with a more slimmer straight leg pant or even a wide leg bottom or maxi dresses at the same time. So I think it works well with these trousers since they're more of a straight leg fit. And I don't know why, I'm just so drawn to them. And I was surprised I was able to create so many different outfits with these shoes recently. So fun, they're so different, they're so fun, great for spring and summer. Next one is this outfit. Man, I love this crop trench, especially pairing it with these navy trousers because the colors are spot on. I mean, these trousers are from Quinn's. This uh, crop trench is from Nordstrom and I was surprised how spot on the colors are. And I actually wanted to pair the navy with brown. It's a color combination I love together. I think it makes pieces look so expensive, just the navy and the brown color combo and also looks so pretty for spring, very fresh. And with the white tank underneath, obviously, just kind of peeking through. Brown slides is like the same ones I've been wearing, like the white ones, I have them in brown. And then I styled my Pauline Paris bag here. I feel like I don't share this bag too often anymore. I have a lot of purses that I have been sharing that are more inexpensive, I've been loving. Um, but I love this Pauline bag with this outfit and the slides. I think it ties the look together really well. I do love matching the color of my bag and shoes together. Again, it kind of just pulls the look together and then going a little bit monochrome with this outfit with the navy trench and the navy bottoms. This last outfit, I just layered a olive blouse over this white tank. So this is something you can also do, especially if it's a little bit cooler. And then as the temperature warms up at the end of the day, you can just pop off the blouse and then just wear the tank underneath if you want to. Try to have the neckline more open so you can kind of see the white tank peeking through. I love the color combination of this as well. The olive, the navy, and the white. Especially the olive and the navy. I didn't think it would work, but I actually really like how they look together. And this outfit, again, very relaxed polished, tailored as well. Something just really easy to throw on and go and you feel very put together and effortless for the day. So that was one base styled seven different ways for you guys. I hope you enjoyed seeing some of these outfit ideas. It's truly amazing how many outfits you can come up with. One base, I mean, you just pretty, pretty much add just all these different layers on top of it, whatever is suitable for the season that we're in. So hopefully you got some good inspiration from this. If you are looking for tons more outfit inspiration, I'll link my recent styling video where I share 26 different outfit ideas with only 10 pieces. But to be interested in anything, of course, I have everything linked down below along with sizing details. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye.